That's what we're gonna do. We're about to bring Mike on the stage, but he's not gonna come out until you guys are hype as shit. So when I say Mike, you say Posner, Mike! Truly Mike Posner, and I want to thank you for listening to KJ103FM.com. One foot out the door. One Just touched down in Indianapolis. We're driving to Wilmington, one of my favorite schools, IU. Got into some mischief the last time I was here. Who the fuck wants to see me at Little Five make some noise? And uh, we're about to kill this show with Little 500, man. It's gonna be crazy. Crazy, crazy, crazy. Couldn't be more excited right now. Look at the smile on my face. On oh, one hour of sleep. That happy. Look, that car has a Michigan license plate. Crazy. <laughs> and uh, I rock with this mic over the laptop and then the other mic over the keys. Gotcha. So I'll, I'll send you signal right now. Good. Well, let's raise. Uh -huh. I want to be man? super loud. How you doing? Good to see you, man. Good to see you as well. <laughs> different if I come back here. Like, I'm gonna have shit on the radio, too. Yeah. So, like, at this point, like, these kids feel like I'm one of them. And I am. Like, I'm supposed to still be in school. I graduated early in December, but I'm supposed to still be at Duke, you know? And, like, they take ownership in, in what I've done. And they should, because they've helped me to get to where I'm at, you know? Like, nobody told them to download my stuff and listen to it. Like, they just did. And that's the reason I'm here. That's the reason you're holding the camera on me right now. So it's really cool to like share this moment with them. We feeling all right, are you? Yeah. I just want to take this moment to fucking thank you guys because this year your support has allowed me to live my fucking dreams, man. I'm like stressed out, my record's not all the way done yet, and I start work tour soon, so there's only like X amount of days for me to finish my album, I have a record on the radio, so like it has to be done in June, but like I really wanted to go out and like see people during this time, because it's going to be different, you know, and it's a lot of work, but I think it's worth it. So that's like in the same cool hotels, like the Hampton Inn. <laughs> <laughs> yeah! That felt like a crowd, sir. Stage, like, they cut that the air down a little bit. Yeah, they talk, I think they talk about it like almost famous. Or I've read it in like Rolling Stone articles. Like, 
is like the loneliest moment there is, right? Because like you're on the stage and there's thousands of people like rocking with you and then in a matter of seconds you're just by yourself. It's like very polar. But those that can those that can master that transition last a long time. So <laughs>